Welcome to JB Technician's Friends, and I am JB. Today, we will talk about the rotary change over switch. This rotary change over switch is a four pole type. What you see here is a four pole rotary change over switch. Okay, it is also called a 102 switch. This rotary change over switch is also known as a 102 switch. It comes in different types like 4 pole, 2 pole, and 6 pole, which means whatever we require in our usage. This rotary change over we will use for our three phase, for three phase electricity lines, which means if you have a three phase electric connection or a three phase generator to manually change between them, we use this, which means we can manually change it ourselves. When we have electricity, it is set to 1, and when electricity goes out and we need the generator, we switch it to 2 to use the generator. So, the points you see here, 1, 2, 3, and 4, as you can see that it is marked RSTX on top, and similarly RSTX on the other side. These points are our supply points. All four of them, okay? Line one, line two, line three, and the neutral wire, even the neutral is disconnected, okay? This side that you see is the electric side. Line one, line two, line three, and the neutral wire. This side that you are looking at is our generator side. Line 1, line 2, line 3, and the neutral wire. This is our generator side. Next, I will show you the load wires that will be connected here. As you can see. These are the contacts where we connect wires. I have installed this wire for testing. Okay. Here we have given one phase in all three terminals. These are our load contacts, which means the three phase load wires will be connected here. Line one, line two, line three, and the neutral load wire. friends now you can see I will now turn it on and show you we have also installed an MCB breaker to show the three phase line the other side is our generator side now I will turn it on for you You can see our MCB has got mine, okay? And as you can see, line one, line two, line three, and this is our neutral wire. The line has come. When we usually keep the electric line on side one, we give the electric line on side one. So I will turn this on for you with a tester. These are our load points. I will connect this tester 
and show you you are watching our tester is on in all three phases one two three on all three our tester is working Now we have turned off the electric line. The electric line is now off. Now we will turn on the generator line, the generator side, okay. Now we are turning on the generator line for the generator side so that you understand. We have turned on the generator line. You are watching. It's line one, line two, line three, and this is our neutral wire of the generator, okay? In the off condition, it has come to the generator side. Now our generator is on. So you will be shown with a tester that our generator is working. These are our load points. You can see that our tester is working. Our bulb, all three contacts are working properly. Now, you have also checked the generator, and we have checked the electric as well. Okay, friends, if by chance electricity also comes back on, there's nothing to worry about. No issue. Another thing I would like to tell you on the go is that this system that I have shown you, this manual system in the form of a rotary changeover, in the coming videos, I will show you. As you can see, we have a contactor here. I will show you how we can use this system, which we are doing manually with a contactor, automatically turning it on and off. It has four contacts on top and four below. The ones on top are called NC, and the ones below are called NO, okay. So, we can perform the same function with this contactor in the coming video with this contactor. I will show you how we can use it automatically, the work we are doing manually. Friends, I see that our viewers are increasing. Many are watching. Our youngsters are coming in large numbers. So, for them, I have made quite a few videos on three phase till now. In the coming videos, I will start from the beginning, from small things, small tasks. I will tell you, because the young boy is coming, I think, starting from those videos, it will help in learning electrical work. If you liked our video, subscribe, like, share, and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you get the coming videos on time. Goodbye, see you in the next video.